चैप्टर टेन एक्सेप्शन हैंडलिंग इन जावा मार्क्स सिक्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज इट इज यूजली अंडरस्टूड दैट अ कंपाइल प्रोग्राम इज एर फ्री एंड विल ऑलवेज डैश सक्सेसफुली एंड सो इट विल डिस्प्ले एंड एक्सिक्यूट सक्सेसफुली ऑप्शन बी क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एंड डैश इज एन इंडिकेशन ऑफ अ प्रॉब्लम दैट अकर्स ड्यूरिंग अ प्रोग्राम एक्सिक्यूशन राइट सो आंसर इज ए एक्सेप्शन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इज डैश इज यूज टू कन्वर्ट द सोर्स कोर्स इन टू ऑब्जेक्ट कोड राइट आंसर इज ए कंपाइलर क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्ड फोर नंबर क्वेश्चन इफ देर इज अंटेक्स एरर इन द प्रोग्राम अ कंपाइलेशन एरर इज डिस्प्ले एंड डैश फाइल इज नॉट क्रिएटेड राइट सो इट विल नॉट क्रिएट अ क्लास फाइल सो सी ऑप्शन क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव द जावा डैश सजेस्ट इन एन आउटपुट the type of error along with the line number where the error has occurred so option a compiler question number 6 it is uh, in the field of the computer science exit code or the exit status indicates where uh, whether the command or a dash executed successfully or not right so b program Question number seven. Code dash indicates that the command executed successfully. So D option zero. Code zero. Then code dash indicates that the some problem occurs while executing the code. Right. So answer is A one. Question number nine. If there is no syntax error in this uh, source code, then the program will compile successfully and will get a dash file. right so answer is c dot class file question number 10 is an attempt to divide any number by 0 used dash exception class right so answer is b arithmetic exception question number 11 the following code will result in dash right so uh, then this code is given right after that what is the answer answer is b arithmetic exception so it will display arithmetic exception right what is the full form of jvm right answer is c java virtual machine question number 13 while performing exception handling one has to try to execute that the program does not dash abruptly or not nor does it generate unexpected output right so answer is terminate a option then question number 24 a dash contains the code that may gives rise to the one or more exception right so answer is a try block question number 15 the dash statement contains a block of statements within the brackets right option is a try statement question number 16 it is uh, the dash is uh, an exception handler right so it is a b catch block question number 17 it is uh, any program which tries to access array elements by specifying index position that is outside the range leads to an dash right so answer is b exception question number 18 is uh, the code that generates exception should be written within the dash so it is written with the try block a option question number 19 there can be multiple dash to handle each type of exception separately right so answer is b catch blocks question number 20 a dash is widely used if a while file needs to be closed or a critical resource is to be released at the compilation of the program right so answer is c it is finally block then question number 21 a dash is widely used if a file needs to be closed or the critical resource is to be released at the compilation of the program at question number 21 answer is c finally block at question number 22 a dash is is uh, associated with the particular try block and it must be located immediately following any catch blocks for the corresponding try block 
and so answer is a finally block question number 23 it is uh, object that one throws must be of the type java dot language dot dash otherwise a compile error occurs right so answer is it is throwable question number 24 when a dash statement it is encounter a search for a matching catch blocks begins the answer is c throw question number 25 there are dash alternative approaches to handle when an exception occurs in a method or a constructor right so answer is b 2 right so two alternatives question number 26 the keyword is the the dash keyword is used with the declaration of method right so answer is d throws 27 which of this uh, keywords is not a part of the uh, exception handling so answer is c thrown question number 28 what is the output of this program right then the answer is b right so it is display answer b right question number 29 29 for each type of exceptions there are corresponding dash class in java right so b exception question number 3030 it is uh, an attempt to convert the string to a number type uses that dash exception class right so answer is c number format exception question number 331 the dash must immediately follow the try blocks right and it is B option catch blocks question number 32 it is the catch code to handle exception has to be written between parentheses right so answer is C question number 33 it is uh, Java supports dash type of exceptions right so answer is a various question number 34 in the single program dash execution uh, exception can occur right so answer is c multiple question number 35 there is the provision in java to support dash exceptions answer is c multiple question number 36 the dash can catch block must be the last block when there are multiple catch blocks and so answer is d default then question number 37 it is for example an object of dash was created when one tries to perform a divide by zero operation right so answer is b arithmetic exception question number 38 the syntax so to throw an exception object is dash so answer is a throw space exception underscore object semicolon option a question number 39 a dash allows creating own exception classes according to the application specific problems and so answer is c it is in the java right question number 4040 a good program must always handle this rather than the program being terminated terminated abruptly and so answer is d exceptions question number 41 which of the following refers to an error conditions in the object oriented programming terminology that's right, so answer is c exception then question number 42 which of the following it is the correct word for all the java exceptions and right, answer is b runtime exceptions then question number 43 which of the following statement is true right the exception and errors are the same things question number 44 it is which of the following element is not include in the try block and right, answer is b the keyword catch 45 which of the following blocks handles or the text appropriate uh, actions when an exception occurs right answer is b catch block question number 46 it is uh, which of the following should be within a catch block its answer is c any number of statement to handle exception option c question numbers 47 
what will happen when a try block does not generate an exception and you have included multiple catch blocks so answer is c no catch blocks execute answer c question number 48 it is uh, which of the following is is an advantage of using a try catch block next answer is c exceptional events are integrated with the regular events question number 49 it is which of the following methods can throw exceptions so answer is c methods with the try block and question number 55050 and it is which of the following it is the least important to know if you want to be able to use a method to its full potential and so answer is c the number of statements within the method 